Welcome or welcome back and I need help at C-Square. In this video clip we will look to the perimeter and the area of this well, pentagon, right? One, two, three, four. We have four, five sides, right? Five sides. It's not a regular pentagon, but it's still a pentagon, right? So how are we gonna do? Let's start, let's say the area. The area of A, B, uh, C, E, D, how I call it, okay, and we're gonna break it in two parts, right, we're gonna have a rectangle and a triangle, right, and the area of the rectangle, that is pretty easy, we have base times height, base times height, and if you notice already count, the base is 2, and the height is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9, that will be 2 times 9, 18. And the area of the triangle. The area of the triangle will be 1 over 2 base times height. And we have the same 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. It should be right here. That's a rectangle. 1 over 2 times 9. That's the base. And the height is this guy. 1, 2, 3. Okay, 9 times 3, 27 over 2. Okay, so we have 18 plus 27 over 2 here, which is what? 36 over 2, uh, 6, uh, 3, I think 63 over 2 if we're on the fraction form. If you're on a decimal, uh, use a decimal. That's the area, 63 over 2 square units, be sure. What about the Perimeter, right? For the perimeter, we may want to look to easy things first. Which one are those? Right? We have a bunch of easy. We have three sides that are easy in this perimeter, right? Uh, which, uh, like I said, which one are those? This one is two. This one is nine. This one is two. We need to find this guy and this guy. Okay? We're gonna do two triangle, right? And the first one here. This is three. This is two. Okay, so we're going to use Pythagorean theorem 3 and 2, and we have a squared plus b squared equals c squared. 3 squared plus 2 squared equals c squared. 9 plus 4 equals c squared. c squared equals 13. So c will be square root of 13, okay, which is b. C, right? So we have BC now. We have this BC. We need to find CE. And again, another triangle. This is 3. This is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7, right? So we have another triangle like uh, this. 7. And three. So another Pythagorean theorem, right? A squared plus b squared equals c squared. So we end up here with seven squared, right? Plus three squared equals c squared. Seven squared, forty-nine plus three squared. That is nine equals c squared. C squared equals fifty-eight, and c will be square root of fifty. Eight. So now we can really do the, put the, all the things together. The perimeter, right? That will be what? It will be the two twos, right? Two plus nine plus two, right? The one that I said that are easy. Two plus nine plus two plus square root of thirteen plus square root of Fifty-eight. Okay, and that'll be two plus two four nine thirteen, right? Um, plus square root of thirteen, and let's see square root of fifteen. Can we simplify that? Uh, two twenty-six four. Um, I don't think so, right? Square root of fifty-eight. We're looking here. Uh, divide by 2, we get uh, 229. No. So that's it. That's it. You cannot simplify. This is the exact answer. If you, if you need an approximation, uh, grab a calculator and 
evaluate and approximate based on how they ask you to do it. Let me let me be sure. This is 58 here. 50, 58. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to click the like button and come back and see Square for more help. Thank you.